Let's give my baby her daily bread here. And yesterday, <clears throat> last night, there was a time I opened my eyes and it kind of hue, a hue, a hue, and it was bluish. And then it turned into uh, like a vapor that had flesh around it. I knew it was flesh, but it didn't look like flesh. And there was Eve. So <clears throat> we're going to welcome Eve back as Mary this time. We're very excited about that. During my celebration, I took some time to uh, <clears throat> have some um, fearless revelations provided to me. Um, one, the church just simply is not doing what it was created to do, how it was created to do it. So if I don't put the truth in front of you and push you towards my prophets, you're not getting true... Um, counsel or um, warnings at times from the Holy Spirit that has seen everything. So it's important that we have our prayer time. It's important that we move forward. But <clears throat> the deliverer will come from Zion. He will turn godlessness away from Jacob. And this is my covenant with them when I take away their sins. All Israel will be saved. <clears throat> All right. As far as the gospel is concerned, they are enemies on your account. But as far as election is concerned, they are loved on account of the patriarchs. For God's gifts and his call are irrevocable. All right. Just as you who were at one time disobedient to God have now received mercy as a result of their disobedience. Okay. So that has to do with... <clears throat> their parents all right <clears throat> and then that's good because my wife has been um advocating for pretty much every single person on earth and it's been difficult to keep up with her demands but i got so much honey the bees in me need babe so much honey the bees envy me all right So another thing that I was praying about, making sure that me and my wife um, have a happy marriage, that she's returned to heaven where she belongs, and all the things that she had to deal with before she doesn't have to, and we finally have that um, marriage that's working like a marriage is supposed to, where there's a spiritual leader, and one thing that sets the church apart as far as the American church and what people are dealing with is Jesus and the Holy Spirit means Jesus could have been ever present in the church as the leader of the church. And it's not like that. There's the familiar spirits and lying spirits and the individuals that are in the building. And they're happy as long as they are under that um, self delusional, everything is fine when you don't have Jesus in your life. So I'm not really, there she is, she just texted. <clears throat> Let me upload this, that's perfect, I love you. <clears throat> 